Hello guys, it's Podgaming here, and I just wanted to bring you a quick little tutorial on what I've found to be quite useful whilst using the amazing ploppable asphalts. Now at the time of recording this video, the two types that I'm using are both via the creator of Ronix. So we have the standard asphalts you can see here, which are overlapping above the actual curb line, and also the second type is the sunken. So these are the ones which go below the curb line, and these are the ones which can cover up already marks on the roads, etc. So the issue I found is once you was able to complete this, for example, these two roads joining together are both a highway and going into a more residential road. So we go from no curbs to curbs. And what we have is this gap here, as you can see. And I've managed to work out a way that we can now complete this and level the two off by using both types of asphalts from Ronix. So using the sunken asphalts, what you want to do is place a line down and then you can raise the road up a tiny bit. This just gives you the angle that you need to combine the two together. So you want the standard uh, road to be a little bit lower down than the actual road you're trying to put the ramp sort of into as you can see here so as I've raised the road up we are now able to higher and lower using the move it mod tool to get the two roads to meet and then a little bit of tidying up allows you then to recreate this and sort of hide away the ugliness of what there was prior to this so guys just a very quick tutorial on how to do so thank you very much for watching any questions by all means let me know otherwise I'll catch you all very very soon thanks for watching and all the best